एंड वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल आई होप एवरी वन इज सेफ एंड हेल्थी We have been hearing a lot about the Pulsar 250F. In fact, we have seen some spy shots as well. So here we are today to discuss about the Pulsar 250. What could you expect and when could it be launched? But before we start unveiling the specifics, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and do ring that bell so that you never miss out update from us. Let's talk about the Pulsar family lineup till date. We all know that the Pulsar series is in a need of upgrade. and with the talks of the new 250 cc engine there are chances that the complete series will get an upgrade after 13 whole years the complete pulsar lineup is divided in two different categories the first one is the sports commuter where it starts from the pulsar 125 and goes all the way up to pulsar 220f now these motorcycle gets two valve dtsi engine whereas the second one is premium sports which includes the rs and the ns So these one get a 6-speed gearbox and have a 4-valve triple spark engine. Now we have already seen a 250 cc engine slammed on the Dominar 250 which is similar to the Duke 250's engine but it goes way premium. Now let's talk about what this new Pulsar 250F would be. As far as we can understand, it is going to be a brand new 250 cc engine developed by Bajaj and it is not going to be similar to the current running Duke 250 and the Domina 250's engine. The ongoing engine had a maximum capacity of 220 cc and hence we are going to get a new one. It will be a two valve engine which will get oil cooling and will be mated with a five speed gearbox. Now this one will get a wet multiplate clutch to keep the cost in check. The motor may generate performance figures close to that of the NS200 currently so that will be maximum power of somewhere around 24 PS and a peak torque of somewhere around 19 Nm along with that the new motorcycle will feature LED tail light LED turn indicators and may have the LED headlight as well it gets a mono shock instead of the dual shock absorbers which is definitely an upgrade and with that is a new exhaust it will also have clip-ons just like the RS200 but then they will cater to a very comfortable riding posture it is said that it might be available in two variants one will be semi fared and the other one will be naked it won't come as a surprise because bajaj has already done that and we have seen it on the pulsar 180 and the 220f in the coming years this new design and this new engine will replace the complete pulsar lineup and you may get to see a new pulsar 160 a new pulsar 180 and then a new pulsar 200 Now this one is a big question will it be the Pulsar 250F there are a few reasons as to why we believe that this 250 update could be something bigger definitely bajaj is planning for a new lineup with the new engine for the sports commuter segment but we believe the Pulsar 250F might impact the NS200 and the RS200 there are major three reasons for it the first one being that the performance figures will be similar The second one is that it is going to be slightly cheaper than the NS200 and definitely cheaper than the RS200. The third one, it will be semi fared, it will get LED turn indicators, LED tail light, might also get LED headlight and an all new instrument cluster. If all this is true, will you pick the NS200 or the Pulsar 250F? Let us know in the comment section below. Now let's talk about if not Pulsar 250F, what it could really be. Remember there were rumors that the AS is coming back for the Adventure Profile Pulsar series. What if the one that we see on spy shots is not the Pulsar 250F but the AS 250? Then it will be even better because we'll get a Adventure Tourer by Bajaj with a 250 cc liquid cooled four valve engine which will be similar from the Domina 250 and it will get six speed gearbox, slipper clutch with dual channel ABS. The performance figure will also be same as the Domina 250. If we look closely at the image, it is a semi fared buffed up motorcycle just like the AS and it gets LED indicators, mono shock and a exhaust similar to that of the RS200. This makes more sense to me. What do you think? Let us know in the comment section below. The last question, when it will be launched and at what price? Originally Bajaj was set to reveal the new motorcycle by the end of August 2021. which might get delayed to October 2021 due to the pandemic situation if the pulsar 250f hits the market it is expected to launch somewhere between 1.3 lakhs to 1.4 lakhs ex showroom and if as 250 is really a thing it is going to be somewhere around 1.6 lakhs because it will be slightly cheaper than the domina but definitely expensive than the rs200 and that brings us to the end 
I hope this video was helpful for you. Do give it a thumbs up and share it with your family and friends. If you are new to our channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring that bell so you never miss out any update from Rev Explorers. You can also go ahead and follow us on Instagram. This is our Instagram handle. We are always there. We are on Facebook and Twitter. If you have any doubts or any queries, you can connect with us on our social media pages or just leave it in the comment section below. We'll see you again in the next video. Till that time, stay home, stay safe. Bye bye. Come to phone.